Okay, hi, I'm Nate Cody. Uh, I'm running for state representative in District 53. I was a former state representative for two terms in this district, and uh, it, was, it was quite effective on uh, not only my legislation, but reaching across the aisle uh, on many issues. For, for example, I was the co-sponsor uh, with Republican Senator Sander, Sander Roof for the Sunshine Portal Act. Uh, and I've co-sponsored a number of bills with uh, some of the uh, people on um, the Republican side of the House. Uh, I try to solve problems, and I try to solve problems meaningfully. Um, my background, I am currently retired and teach part-time at Diana Community College. Uh, I teach such courses as business management, organizational theory, labor relations, and related uh, type of, of jobs. Uh, I do have a graduate degree in education as well as some other degrees, which is a, is a positive as far as I'm concerned. We have a number of issues. I, oh, by the way, I owned three businesses in my past. Uh, one, the first business that I uh, was a partner in, I did the business plan before I even graduated from college. I was a senior in college. It is now DeLorme Mapping. I sold out to Dave DeLorme, and it's a huge business, as we know, and I've had a couple of consulting businesses as well. Uh, as far as uh, our problems and issues in the state, I want to work with not only my constituents, but colleagues in, in the House and in the Senate to resolve some of our financial issues, our economic issues, and our public education issues. Uh, we do, do need to approach that. We uh, Every year things seem to change and we need to get a handle on it and I'm willing to do that with both sides of the house. Working as a team and also bringing my background 31 years in human resources into play uh, and human resources, you know, I became an expert in such things as pay and compensation, uh, training and development which is very important to our future if we're having a trained labor force. Uh, I'm Rick Little, uh, run for state representative in District 53. Uh, I'm a small business owner out in Chaparral, New Mexico, and uh, we move buildings and structures and houses, that kind of thing. Have a quite an extensive background, I've been doing that for 40 years and uh, in, in business. And um, I have uh, seven children, ten grandchildren, and one more on the way, so be living here hopefully right before the election. Uh, I'm running for this office because, uh, and, and I am the, the current state representative, but I am running for this office because I, I believe there's a, uh, uh, I'm a free market enterprise type of a person. I believe the free market enterprise is what, what, what makes things tick better. I think uh, less government in most cases, not that I'm against regulation, those kind of things, but uh, um, government interference I think slows down uh, the economy, which is a point to where we're at right now with our economy and the shape that it's in. And I believe that uh, with my background in business, that that's a, that's a very important uh, part of what it takes to, to uh, run our state. Um, bringing jobs to this state uh, it's for the economy, again, is a major issue that I think we, we have to uh, really get into. Uh, regulations in our tax code and those type of things need to be worked on so we can make this a business-friendly state. If we can, if we can make it a business-friendly state for not only the businesses here, but bringing business in, we can uh, uh, then go ahead and our, our tax reserves for the state uh, will we'll go up with more people with jobs and more business in the state. So, um, I uh, also uh, I, I, education is a big issue. I'm, uh, you know, with the position we're in in our state with with education, and we've been there for. Uh, 30 years, and uh, there's th those those type of issues have really got to come to the forefront. We've got to do something about changing our education. Around.